Hello, welcome to the Gary Lotus Podcast of Dead Side. And I'm Jake Clalo person. This is Destiny, that came out this week. What was that, it's, mate? It, it's loading the game. Five, five out of twelve? Yes. Six it, out of twelve? It's got six out of twelve guardians in the lobby, basically. Oh. Right, and I want to change that, actually. It's a good point. Um, there you No, wrong bit. Over here. Have you changed the colour of Peter Dinklage yet? What? You can change the colour of Peter Dinklage. Oh, no, I haven't. You haven't? Oh, you don't have any more colours. You can unlock colours to change the colour of Peter Dinklage. Awesome. Yeah, it's like the beta, except there's more to do, but still not quite a lot to do. Are you enjoying it, Dan? Yeah. yeah. I, it, it, it's good in terms of, like, the quality that it's made, but not necessarily in it being a good game, if that makes sense. No. There's nothing wrong with it, but there's nothing... That stands eh. out. Yeah. Okay. I'd give it a 6 out of 10. I don't have it yet. Right. I'd say if you if you are bored and nothing else to play, yeah, get it. If you're excited for Destiny, get it. And if you're like, meh, done. I'll probably like wait till it's on sale or something. I would suggest that for you. Yeah. Oh, because there's a lot of other things that I'm looking forward to, like this GTA. Speaking of, there's a release date for that, but we'll get to that. We'll get to What's that. What's the other one? Alien, I Shadows of Mordor, a shit ton of other things. Destiny, uh, not Destiny, Disney Infinity 2.0. For you. That's like seven days time. Oh, you're on Mars. I am on Mars. I'm always on Mars at the moment. I, it doesn't seem to be very varied maps either. You seem to get like a stream of like, I'll be playing for half an hour now and I'll always get this map. But the next time I come on, I might get a different map for the entire time that I'm on. It's weird like that. <sighs> oh, pardon me. Bravo team! Which one is you? I, I didn't see. Okay. News. That's what this is for. This is what the podcast, what we do. Uh, first, the S Pen, S E S P N boss, said that esports aren't real sports. And I'm kind of with him on that. What do you think, Dan? Oh, um, no, they're not sports. No. They, they definitely deserve their own word. I Esports, it's, it fits, but you're not going to start seeing it on ESPN. Well, no, way. and I don't think we should either. No, because ESPN is for sports, and esports are people clicking. Oh, you died. That's that's not the ideal thing, for those who don't know. What's happening? What are you doing? Change my sensitivity. Oh, uh, yeah. There's a, a the next news. Um, there's new Apple shit. I don't know much about this though. Oh, um, there's the iPhone six. There's the iPhone six plus, What's which the difference? It, it's bigger. Like the iPhone six is like nine percent bigger than the iPhone five S, and then the iPhone six plus is like nine percent bigger than the iPhone six. It's yeah. It's, it's okay. Yeah, it's stuff and things. And then there's the Apple Watch. Yep, yeah, there's the Apple Watch. That it's a, it's a, yeah, it's a smart watch that does stuff and things. As long Many as you have Apple, it does. It does do a hell of a lot of stuff. Does it? Yes. Like everything. Like you don't need a phone. But it is a it. screen that's like. It teeny is. Tiny. It, it's a team tight screen. Why do Why do the companies keep thinking that we want bigger phones? Like I'm quite content with my phone size. Yeah. Event like if you wanted a bigger screen, you'd get a tablet, wouldn't you? Yes. If you want a bigger screen, you go for a bigger screen. But for a phone, you need something that goes about the length of ear to mouth. Yes. So I don't get why they're doing it even longer. It, Eventually, you have to start like moving the phone as you talk. Yeah. It's... Hello? S sorry, sp speak now. You can't see the action he's doing, but he's gesturing as if to make that bit make sense. Yeah. It's like I'm jerking off an enormous penis that's next to my head. Ooh, heavy ammo. Heavy ammo. For my rocket launcher. Oh, you have a rocket launcher. I'm a, yeah, the Titan class is like really a melee, melee, however you want to pronounce it, class. Melee, I would pronounce it. Anyway. Um, like that. So that's, that, there's Apple. That, that was that shit. Do you, are you going to get the new iPhone? No, maybe. One of my phones wants an upgrade. When it wants an upgrade. When it wants an upgrade. When it wants, when it wants an upgrade. There I'll you go it. again, saying that uh, Apple products have feelings and shit. What, do I? You said that, said something like that last week, and I can't remember what it was. Do I? I think it was it was either last week or the week before that you said that an, that an iPhone should think it's better than other phones or yeah, something like that. Yeah, definitely. That's not emotions that you should think of this better because it is. But anyway, um, I don't listen to myself. I would advise against everyone else doing that as well. Well, listening to myself or listening to you? Not listening to me. Listen to yourself by all means. No one knows you better than you, but don't listen to me. Except your mum. Yeah. Well, no, mum doesn't know me that well. She knows me pretty well. I don't know, but mum's always like to play. I had a phantom poo earlier. Phantom poo. Like, 
I looked down the toilet, there was no poo there. I wiped, there was no wipage. But I wipage. had pooed. I don't know, what would you call... Okay, there was no skid marks on the toilet roll. But I had pooed. I know I pooed. Because you felt it. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's an interesting thing. phenomenon, isn't it? Skadoosh! Have you killed anyone yet? Yeah. Oh, yes. That one, one there, at I least. a couple of people, at least. Maybe. Maybe. Ne- next, next news? Next, next oh, news. fuck. Ooh. Shoulder barge. Ooh. Charge, sorry. Shoulder charge, that was. This is currently a rumour, I think. I'm not sure if this has changed. But Notch might be selling Mojang to Microsoft for two no, they billion it. dollars. He confirmed that he had started the talks off. Yeah. They, they haven't come that it's actually being sold, but they are in talks of it. Yeah. Um, he started the talks off and he said that he's going to leave the company as soon as it gets sold. It's like, what? I think this started off as, um, it was a rumour in uh, the Wall Street Journal, I think. Because, of course, they deal with all that kind of stuff. And um, there was loads of articles talking about it and only one of them said that Notch actually started the talks. And, yeah, Notch said something like, yeah, we're thinking about doing it. And if we do, oh, that was a hell of a shot. It was. That was one hell of a shot. Not said that if it goes through, he's gonna leave Mojang. Yep. Which is kind. Of like take, it's a it's a douchey move. Take the money and run. But then again, yeah. There's nothing else that Mojang does. They no, 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 no. They do. <laughs> no, they, they they have made other games, Jake. They made scrolls. He started making that other game, but that just fell through, and he didn't finish it. I don't know if there's been any other games that they've actually completed. Apart from one which was like um, part of the game jam, which was quite a small game. Ooh, Other than that, they haven't done much. It's a Mojang is a very one trick pony, but Mark, um, Minecraft is a very big thing to own because it's like Tetris because it's, it's going to be on every system forever, basically. Oh, what was that? That was my um, my super duper. Your super duper. Right? I, I it. It's called like ground pound or something. Basically, I punch the floor and it leaves an electrostatic field. But do you think it's worth two billion now? Yeah, I think yeah. Fra- I think it has. It, I think Minecraft on its own is worth that amount. Yeah, but that's basically what they're buying. Yeah, Minecraft and, I, and scrolls. I totally think it's worth it. I think um, it it's got so much room for expansion and it. it it's definitely an endless. It's seemingly endless at the moment. Though, it, it, it? Yeah. Okay, I'll give you that. It's probably got an end to it. They keep adding new animals and stuff, but eventually you're going to have every animal that exists in real life, and then you can't add any more. But you can. you got Endermen. I, I do think it's got a long way to go, and two billion is a fair trade for it, if you've got two billion. Which and the know-how. That, well, I think they're going to like keep everyone on at the company, so they'll just do yeah. their thing, and it will just be Microsoft who owns it. I, and I definitely think that's a smart move for Microsoft. Yeah. It's definitely well played if it goes through. Notch apparently doesn't really... Do much now. He passed on the development of um, Minecraft to, quite a while ago. Yeah, like as soon as it came out, around about, he passed on the development to add new stuff and shit to someone else. I can't remember his name. Do have a ponytail. Yeah. He, everyone uh, should watch um, Minecraft: The Story of Mojang. It's quite a good documentary. You can get that on GOG now, because GOG does movies and he does an indie game, the movie Minecraft: The Story of Mojang, and other ones. It's yeah. Yeah. It's, yeah. A, it's a good... good what's going to ha- what's gonna happen to the PS4 and PS3 copies? Dragon, Microsoft will I still... Think... Do you think they'll um, uh, like retract it, or do you think they'll license it to them for a higher fee? I reckon... Or is the current licensing agreement like withholding? Like, Is it still standing like, regardless? I would say the current license, licensing agreement is still standing, I guess. But I think also... But it could be subject they would to bring change. It, out. it could be because subject to change. You so. w- if you want it to be the new Tetris, you need to bring it out and everything. Because I think that's what... The thing that they're mostly going for, I'm not sure if they're thinking of it in the terms of the new Tetris, but that's basically what it is. Yeah, it's, like, it, it's, it's already on like iPad, iPhone, and things like that as well. Yeah. I own PC, Xbox 360, Xbox One, tablet. I've got... Fucking loads of other versions. I've only got PC, Xbox One, Xbox 360. The other ones I've got. But I've still bought it three times. That's yeah. th- That's the point, is that... You're going to buy it on new systems and shit. There's a lot of money to be made in it. Anyway. That's what we think. And that's the news. There's more news. Oh, okay. But I wanted to say that that's the news. Oh! Could have waited till the end. Ah! That happens a lot. You end up killing people at the same moment they kill you. That happens a hell of a lot. The exact same moment. Destiny. 
speaking of the game. Like it came out game. and stuff. And it shipped, keyword, $500 million worth of Destiny. In day one, wasn't it? On release day. Yeah. yeah. That was shipped, though, not sold. Didn't that break a record for the uh, like most sales day one of a new IP? Uh, it broke the record both for biggest selling, uh, biggest selling new franchise in history and biggest selling day one digital download as well. Oh, really? Yeah. I suppose that's partially to do with the pre-purchase thing that they started on Xbox. Yeah, that's probably going to be a big factor of that. Yeah. So it's the first game to have it, wasn't it? Uh, no, I think PS4 also had pre- pre- pre-purchase. Yeah, they've really. had it for a little while, though. But, I mean, on Xbox One. But I think it's mostly to do with the fact that it's Bungie, and Bungie is a sort of Xbox thing to a lot of people, even though it's it was yeah. more of a PlayStation thing this time around with the exclusive exclusive stuff that they had. I can't remember what it was exclusive for a while. The beta was, wasn't it? Yeah, um, stuff and things. This is the first thing Bungie's really done other than Halo, isn't it? Like in a long time, anyway. Yeah. Or it's the biggest thing they've been known for. Did you know that Halo was originally going to be a Mac exclusive? Yep. That's a really weird thing that I thought, when I found out, I was like, wow. That's one of those facts that a lot of people throw about as like a wow fact to them. It is, isn't it? Yeah. It's... Oh, no! Oh, oh. I deserved to die there. I fucked that up. You deserved it. You I don't, did don't talk it. like that, Dan. You never deserved to I, die. I, 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 mi- I missed a punch. He didn't see me, and I pointed a punch, and I missed. I deserved that. Whatever you say. Can you dance? Yeah. Dance, <laughs> dance to my death. That was great. I love that. Or, if you don't feel like playing, you could just sit down and take in the scenery. You're not looking at my scenery now. Oh, that's that's some lovely scenery there. Your balls. You can point and you can wave. Or you can just shoot people. Maybe. 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 What other news you got? Uh, Resident Evil Revelations 2 is going to yes. be episodic. The most pointlessly episodic thing ever because it's going gonna, it's gonna to be done and then they're going to release it over a period of four days. Four episodes. Is that what, the, is that what they've days. said? Really? Four episodes of the course of four days. That definitely seems well. Five ninety nine an episode. So that, what does that come? This is dollars. So that comes to $34-ish. Or you can buy the whole thing for more than that, or by retail for even more than that. I can't remember the exact numbers though. So yeah. Oh no. Once a week for four weeks, sorry. Still pretty pointlessly episodic because it's pretty much going to be done by the time the first episode comes out. Yeah. We lost. That's bad. But I have now got heavy ammo. Blew myself up. You wasted it. Well, the game's over! Well, you don't you keep it afterwards, right? Okay. No. Oh. Not from game to game done. Fair enough. Uh, and GTA 5 for Xbox One and PS4 set to release on November 18th and January 27th on PC. Oh, I like this with Destiny while I mentioned it. Random people get random bits each game. Like, there, there's no oh. system to it. It's just... Random. Yep. Completely random. Yep. Not based on level or anything. So it's not based on level. It's based on, uh, on a random number generator, I believe. Wow. I do like my random number generators. So we finally have a GTA 5 release date. I was, I think I read somewhere, don't hold me to this because I can't find it now, but that um, if you pre-order or if you get limited edition, you get like a million in, in-game credits. Yeah, I think I said that, that you get, you certainly get an amount of money for pre-order on the, in the online. And that's all I have. Is there anything else you want to mention, Dan? Not that I can think of, we'll see. Disney Infinity got the Winter Soldier toy. Did Toy, it? Or figure, apparently. Yeah. Is that a Yondu? That was Yondu, yes. Can you get him in Disney Infinity? You probably took one off. It looks like it. Oh, I have to get it now. I'm getting it anyway. I have a spare copy if you want it. Maybe. Possibly. So, yeah. And that's the news. Oh, God. Bye!